Belize's female cycling sensation, Kaya Katus, has landed a significant achievement in her cycling career. Tariq Kano, who is himself aspiring to become the next cycling president, made the announcement. Kaya becomes the first female and the first Belizean born to get signed to American pro cycling team, Elias Sweats. Um, you know, I just want to let everybody know about this big accomplishment, what it means not only to her, but to the country as well, and the cycling community now. Katus explained what it took for her to reach here. It took a, up, a couple of years going back and forth every summer um, in hopes that, you know, something like this would come true. Uh, finally, amidst the COVID pandemic, uh, myself and a couple other Belizeans had the privilege of racing this summer in Chicago at the Intelligentsia Cup. And um, this is where the opportunities stem from now. At her side in support of the contract today was Deputy Director of the National Sports Council, Marvin Otley. When something like this do happen, um, definitely as a country we have to celebrate it and embrace it as, as, as much as possible. Sometimes in sports there's just a small window and different sports have different background in regards to your age and that kind of stuff. And her window appears now and it's only best that she, she try to get in. Before now, Katus had been raising funds to sponsor younger female cyclists to ride their own races. Now she hopes this new arrangement will complement her office as counselor for youth and sports. I wouldn't say that it impacts my work as a counselor. I would say it enhances it because of the new opportunities that I will be able to bring to more youths of the city, and not, not only the city, and by extension, the entire country, in particular, um, youths who are interested in cycling. My portfolio, my biggest portfolio as a council is youth and sport, and I will definitely be making sure that that is fulfilled to my utmost best. And if you're thinking that you'll be seeing less of Kaya in Belize, she says it's just the opposite. She'll be right here carrying out her councillor duties. These races are 60 to 70 minutes long. They race by time, they race on a set course. It's not here in Belize where you ride all the way out to Cayo and come back. You know, it's not a five, six hour race. So training for races of shorter distance will definitely fit right within my schedule. As she pedals onto her professional cycling career, Katus hopes this accomplishment encourages younger athletes to pursue their goals. For years, as athletes, we have been told that Sport is just a hobby, and it's just something that you should do in your spare time. Get a real job. But today I am grateful to say that sport may no longer be a hobby of mine. Kudos to Kaya Katus for having made Belize proud once again for being the first Belizean-born cyclist to ride professionally. Reporting for News 5, I'm Marion Ali.